Everyone knows this feeling. You're sitting in class, watching the clock, getting ready for the weekend, thinking about some fun plans you want to make. The teacher is wrapping up and you can feel the sweet freedom on the horizon. Then BAM! They give you a massive homework assignment and your weekend just got blown up. Or did it? AI chatbots are becoming popular and some kids are using a tool called ChatGPT to do their homework for them. But hold up, isn't that cheating? Aren't there ways to tell if someone's used ChatGPT? And does it actually do a good job? Let's find out. This is Kayden Explains, ChatGPT and homework. We actually use ChatGPT to write a line of the script. Watch closely and try and guess which one. We'll tell you at the end of the video if you guessed right. We see artificial intelligence in pop culture a lot, and it often looks like this. Goodbye. But this is what we got. That's someone using chat GPT and a 3D printer to write their homework. Forget the 3D printer. What exactly is ChatGPT? ChatGPT is a language model developed by OpenAI that can generate human-like text and engage in conversations with users on a wide range of topics. Elon Musk is one of its founders. And it's the fastest app ever to reach 1 million users. ChatGPT reached that milestone in just five days. You use it by giving it prompts, kind of like asking it questions, and it will generate a text-based response. But how does it actually work? Let's break up the name. Chat comes from the word chat bot, a software used to conduct online conversations through text or text-to-speech. GPT stands for Generative Pre-Trained Transformer 3. No, 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 not that kind of transformer. GPT is one of the largest and most advanced language models in the world. And that language model is what trains chat GPT to understand human language patterns. So that's what it stands for. What it means is... It uses artificial intelligence. Before um, you know, it was turned out um, to the public and people were allowed to ask it, uh, it was trained. Uh, so it was trained with about, I think I was told three billion words of text um, consisting of documents, articles, periodicals, um, anything text related so that it would understand um, really how to respond to a query. Since the dawn of school, kids have been trying to find ways to get around and get out of homework. Cheating is nothing new, and right now students are using ChatGPT to do their homework. Study.com surveyed over a thousand students, and 89% of them said that they use ChatGPT to help with their homework. If you have ChatGPT generate the content of your homework and submit that, I think that's cheating. But does it work? Can ChatGPT get good grades? I think it can probably do even better than a B in most situations. Maybe B plus, maybe not A minus. So yeah, it works. Crazy. I guess that just means homework is finished and everyone's going to use ChatGPT for everything. And we can just sit back and relax. Not quite. Here's why. There are actually tools that help detect the likelihood that the text was written by AI, like Originality AI and GPT-0. So you can use it, but you'll probably get caught. The end of homework might be a bust. Does that mean ChatGPT is dead? We're going to have to reconceive homework a little bit. Um, I think that we're going to have to teach students how to use these tools. Okay, if you haven't guessed which part of the video was written by AI, take a second and guess. I've entered each line of the script into an AI content detector and voila, it was this part. ChatGPT is a language model developed by OpenAI. Busted. 
So, where does AI go from here? Well, that's a whole nother explainer. That's it for Can Explains. For CBC Kids News, I'm Abigail Dove.